Welcome to the full training of Windows 10 series. This is Zia Maliki from Information Technology. You are watching the 12th part of the full training of Windows 10. In the previous video, I showed you how to use the content search feature in Windows 10. If you remember from the last video, we can use the search box at the bottom left side of our screen to search for anything in our computer, whether they are applications such as Word or Excel, documents that we have created, control panel settings, or even the internet. In today's short video, I'm going to introduce you to the File Explorer window. The File Explorer, which is easily accessible via this icon right here on the taskbar, is quite familiar to us. This is the place where we access our files, hard drives, and other folders such as the document folder, the download folder, pictures, and search box and even the network drive where we have stored our files. We have access to our drives such as C drive, our network drives, and if we have more than one drive in our computer, we will also see the DRE drives as well. We can also access our external drives in here such as a USB drive or an external hard disk and the DVD drive from here. It is just like what we had in the past, very familiar. I'm going to introduce you to some new features of the File Explorer. Let's start a new document. I will launch Microsoft Word and start a new simple document. I'll, I will write, hi friends, thank you for watching this tutorial. Now I will go to the file menu and save as. Let's go to this PC. I will save it on my desktop and I will call it YouTube Friends. Now once I close the program, I can then access that document whenever I like by going back to the Explorer. By the way, there is a keyboard shortcut to open the Explorer view. Hold down the Windows key and hit an E. That will bring up the Explorer view. So Windows E for Explorer. Let's do it once again. I'm pressing Windows E, which will bring the Explorer view for me. When I open the Explorer, I straight away see my frequent folder. This is a new feature and I also see recent files and if I scroll down a little bit more you can see the YouTube friends document I just worked on is under my recent files. So this is the new features in the file explorer window. That's all I have for you in this tutorial. Now I would like you to pause the video and practice what you have learned in this video. In the next tutorial, we are going to talk more about the file explorer. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. It's goodbye for now.